I spent all my time reading my ex-girlfriend's food blog. It wasn't even interesting. It was just the only place she forgot to block me. So I had to check. <laughs> there are no photos of her, but she writes about salad a lot. So I know she looks great, which is frustrating. There's a week where it's all pastries. I was like, she's coming back, but that didn't happen. The hardest part of that was always like reading it and then having to follow the recipe to find out whether or not it's enough food for two people. Like, that's the only way I can tell if she moved on, you know? My roommate keeps coming in the kitchen like, hey man, that's a lot of pasta. I'm like, it's not that much pasta, okay? <laughs> this is a normal amount. I'm gonna eat this by myself for sure. I'm eating it later. I'm like, this is so much fucking pasta. <laughs> this is enough for three people. What does that mean? 